choke on a piece of concrete and literally go to hell. I will see you in fucking hell, you fucking asshole. Pedal my way back. Sorry. I can't hear you. Aquaman. Your Honor, yes, Miss Heard made some mistakes, but don't we all? Look, I don't know how about you, but I personally do not shit in bed after a fight with my husband. Right, but this situation is just like in Beauty and the Beast. I'd say more like in Willy Wonka and his chocolate factory. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Your Honor, my client did hurt Mr. Depp, but she also did love him and cared for him. She chopped his finger like a nasty freaking lettuce. She's Taurus. Objection, you cannot use astrology as an excuse. Your Honor, in a country where we normalized male pregnancy, there can be no objections. We call it freedom. I mean, fair enough, I guess. Господи, надо было в цирке оставаться работать. Mr. Depp, with, with, with what force do you usually kiss women? Now, Mr. Depp, you said you poured yourself a mega pint of wine. What is a mega pint exactly? Across the face. Did I read that good right? Did I read that right? I actually have some visual aid for your mega pint, okay? Uh, so, was this a mega pint of wine? When you kiss a woman, do you hold her tenderly by the face? Oh, my queen. No? Mr. Depp, in your previous statement, you said that your ex-wife, Mrs. Hurd, allegedly put fecal matter in your bed. Yes, because she did. I do have some questions regarding the uh, legitimacy of that statement. Oh my god. How do you know it was fecal matter? Was this a mega pint of wine? Right, I understand it smelled like fecal matter, but did it feel like fecal matter? What? Did you put your hand in it? Do you, do you stroke her a little bit? Like, a little more intense? It could have been your pudding. She enjoys a nice it. pudding on a Sunday uh. morning. Mr. Depp, did you taste the pudding? Do you kiss her like this? If he did not taste the brown substance the brown on his pillow, I shit. cannot confirm I, and or oh. deny that it was fecal matter. Was this <gasps> your makeup? You've got to be kidding me. You've got to be kidding me. I'm so confused. Objection. What the I'm hell? just as confused as you are. You I don't know how they let God. me pass this through the freaking airport. <laughs> And he insinuated, just insinuated, like I was doing the drugs. <laughs> and then I, and then. And the thing. What did? What was I trying to make up? All right, you have a great rest of your day. Great, Amber, sweetie, you did great today. I'm gonna keep it up. You did awesome. Um, but for tomorrow, first things first. When you're crying, when you're crying tomorrow, don't forget to pretend to wipe your tears. Very important details matter. Also, when you're telling these stories, really hyperventilate and struggle to. Struggle to get those words out, but do not forget to wipe the fake tears. You forgot to do that today. Details matter. It's important. Okay? I got a jar of dirt. I got a jar of dirt. And guess what's inside it? I just, in my head, instantly think of Kate Moss and the <gasps> stairs. And I swung at him. Oh, no. He ripped my dress, the uh, strap top part of my dress. I had just dyed this thing um, myself, pink. And this is one of those things I, I was like, you know, that's my. The three four that I donated my jizz to for a while, staying there. Leave me fucking be Officer Squarehead. Correct?
Yes. Do you know the Muffin Man? The Muffin Man? The Muffin Man. Yes, I know the Muffin Man. Who lives on Drury Lane? Well, she's married to the Muffin Man. The Muffin Man? The Muffin Man! And I was walking out of the bedroom, slapped me across the face. I turned to look at him. And I said, Johnny, you hit me. You just hit me. My dog stepped on a bee. My dad has to pee. My mom's stuck in a tree. My squirrel got bit by a flea. Without my glasses, I cannot see. And I was walking out of the bedroom, slapped me across the face. I turned to look at him. And I said, Johnny, you hit me. You just hit me. Oh my God!